Duchenne muscular dystrophy is a degenerative muscle wasting condition it's normally diagnosed between the ages of say two and four. The boys are all normal progression until then, um, walking, talking. Normally by the age of sort of 11 or 12, a lot of the boys are in wheelchairs. You get leg weakness first, so they become wheelchair bound. Then you've got your arms get weak, your jaw gets weak, so it gets hard to chew. Every muscle is affected, so it's a, grad it's a horrible thing. At the moment there is no cure. Um, so they need people to help them with most day-to-day -day tasks. Luckily a PlayStation or Xbox controller isn't one of those, so they can still manage that, so it's good. So when Cameron was diagnosed, Jordan was on the way. Then when Jordan was born, he had a test and obviously he, ha he has it as well. Although, you know, it's, it's devastating. I, I don't actually know any different and I wouldn't have it any other way because obviously I love them both to bits and wouldn't change a thing. I wish they didn't have to suffer because it's just terrible seeing them suffering and you can't do anything to help. All we can do is try and make life as easy as possible. The Duchenne Family Support Group is a brilliant charity. The main thing they do is they organise um, for families to get together, um, which is really important. For, you know, because if you're coming up against some problem, chances are some other family have dealt with it, been there, won it, done the t-shirt, you know. It's a real lifeline for the families to meet other families that are going through the same thing, because it makes you realise that it's not just you. Because although it's allegedly a rare condition, Duchenne, I'm not so sure it is that rare, because, <laughs> you know, when you meet lots of other people, you know, you realise that you're not the only ones out there. But I think the work they do is fabulous. Wherever you go, with, with people with a disability is very expensive because there's lots of equipment that you need to take. You know, it does make a holiday very expensive, but with the subsidy that the Duchenne Family Support Group can give, it makes it affordable. And they've researched everything and looked into the places they take you. And they know that you can hire hoists or you can hire beds and that's what they like to give you a subsidy for. So that it makes it into a normal holiday rather than a you know, a very expensive one. And it makes a lot of difference, does to us, so I'm sure it does to other families too. Every family is different, but our family are, we do everything, we do as much as we can, as often as we can, for as long as we can. So we go out and do lots of things, we try and holiday as much as we can, and I think that's the way to be, you've got to just do everything while you can. <laughs>